Hey guys, I'm a tennis dog pincher and today we will leave the area for tennis dogs and take a look at a brand new investment opportunity. And that stock is Joby Aviation, a high flyer in urban air mobility, so basically a big drone. Joby Aviation just went public four days ago through a spec. A spec, meaning special purpose acquisition company, or also called blank check company, is exclusively intended to list shares on the stock exchange rather quickly. For that purpose, Joby Aviation merged with reInvent Technology. So if you're looking for Joby Aviation's chart, you gotta search for reInvent Technology. So let's see what we've got here. First, we're gonna check out if there will be a market for urban air mobility at all. Back in 1940, Henry Ford already said, mark my word, a combination of an airplane and motor car is coming. You may smile, but it will come. And here we are today. Flying has always been the dream of mankind and has already pushed through as the primary mode of transport regarding long and middle distances. Besides, the average amount of kilometers being flown is decreasing, so the majority of flights are middle distance flights. Think of our grandparents who did an East Coast, West Coast trip by car. Nowadays, you're just gonna catch a cheap flight. So we can spot the trend that air traveling for even shorter distances stays attractive. Should this trend continue, then the urban sector is the next that takes off. And electric engines will only speed up this development. Nowadays, we have a huge amount of metropolitan areas and therefore lots of traffic jams. Worldwide, that traffic challenge gains importance especially as you can see in Asia and South America. With a passenger drone, you would not only save time by reaching your destination via beeline, but it is also a quite elegant way of traveling. If I could choose between an Uber or an Uber Air at a similar rate, uh, my choice would definitely be the later one. Also, Morgan Stanley is on the same page here and published a blue paper about it. Let's highlight the most important aspects, meaning the market estimates for 2040, regarding urban air mobility. Three scenarios have been examined. A weak market penetration, the so-called bear case, a moderate market penetration, the base case, and the strong market penetration, the bull case. For a strong market penetration, the technology has to be developed on the one side, and on the other, laws and legal regulations need to favor urban air mobility. The estimated yearly revenue for 2040, considering a bear case, is 615 billion US dollars. Looking at the base case, it's 1.5 trillion US dollars. And the bull case, even 2.9 trillion dollars. Let's apply this to Joby Aviation. So if Joby Aviation would only reach a market share of 5% regarding the bear case, that would mean a yearly revenue of 75 billion US dollars. A quite enormous sum. Quick comparison, 2020 Tesla had a revenue of 31.5 billion US dollars. So why Joby Aviation? Joby Aviation developed an all-electric plane. That plane is supposed to reach the market maturity within the next three years. The plane's range is 240 kilometers with a maximum travel speed of 320 kilometers an hour. What I like best in Joby is the rather low noise level. And keeping that noise level down, especially while takeoff and landing in urban areas, is to me one of the biggest obstacles in urban air mobility. That flight taxi has a noise level below 70 decibel. We can see that that is something between normal speech and a vacuum cleaner. To me, that seems quite acceptable. To get an impression of the noise, here is a sequence of Joby Aviation CEO with a flight taxi taking off in the background. To all of you in the global community for cheering us on, we still have a long and challenging journey ahead of us. But with the reInvent team at our side, we are one step closer to making this fantastic future real. Besides that, Joby Aviation has got pretty strong partners. Toyota and Uber Technologies invested together an amount of 470 million US dollars in Joby. And if well-known companies are investing hundreds of millions of dollars, we can consider Joby Aviation to be well-reviewed. But of course, Joby is not the only one wanting to discover urban skies. 
It seems regarding the American market, Joby is the most developed. Though based on flight hours and delivered products, Ehang from China is the global market leader. Even though Ehang's share price have dropped by a lot in the past days due to a short seller report. Because of the US location, Joby could push through, since a lot of customers are excluding Chinese products when it comes to safety relevance. Why did I buy today? During the past days, the trading markets have decreased, which offered a good investment opportunity. I bought Joby Aviation, or reInvent Technology, February 25th at around 13 US dollars. Joby Aviation is a highly speculative investment since a marketable product has not yet been developed. And also, I'm not a financial advisor, so these videos are only for entertainment purposes. But if you're up for more fascinating stocks like these, follow Miss Penny Stock Pincher.